What is going on, True Believers? Guys, we talked about Fias. That's this little gem over here for the Nysperience LitCraft game engine. And here we are with a nice little pump. Let me show it to you. If you like this type of content, make sure you hit the like button on the way in. All right, so guys, you can't see it from here. But if you remember, uh, I gave you a pre-sale that was LitCraft. That was the Fias token. We were buying it off of the Devi ecosystem. Uh, our initial price was six cents. And then what happened? Uh, well, if you played it the way that you're supposed to, the way we talk about all the time, then it ran all the way up on the launch to 16 cents. Uh, and that was on MEXE over here on um, uh, Uniswap. It ran up to 16 and a half cents. So you made yourself a nice little earn off of it. And then, of course, that's where the dump started because everybody who was in on the presale, that's what we do. We dump. Uh, and then we wait until we try to find the bottom. Now, you and I have talked about the bottom uh, of this a couple of times. And when you kind of zoom out, what are we looking for? What we're looking for is a rounding of that bottom. Well, we started to get that rounding over the last couple of days, and now we've got this enormous spike. Well, if you accumulated during this rounding period right here at about one penny, you're gonna feel pretty good today because you're up 65% overall to 1.871 cents. Now, as you know, uh, I showed you my lock tokens. I have 62,000 of these tokens, and um, I'm looking forward to really have an explosive sort of price action. Why is that gonna happen? Well, and by the way, this is what it looks like on MEXC right now. You can see the enormous spike is starting to happen over here too, up 42% on the day. And every once in a while you'll see a, a you know a weird sort of play happen and it you know remember your trade master ninja the high iq indicator is going to give you some buy signals hasn't given a buy signal yet but it did change its momentum to bullish which means that it suspects as well uh, and their live trend up here is in green as well. So it's predicting at this point that we are in a bullish pattern for FIAS to start a breakout. Now, it took you a stop loss over here on a short that it gave you. And look, it's been pretty good about giving you the positions on each and every one of these. And now, where does that leave us? Well, it leaves us right here on this little spike. Now there was a big buy and sell sweeping the price and that happens every once in a while because you got big buyers step in, kind of clear out the, 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 the longs and shorts, if you will. And so now what we did was come up here to the 200 MA and the next step is gonna be a breakout above the 200 MA with a confirmation there and then a breakout to some previous ranges, a previous range. The next previous range can be two and a half cents uh, it would look like to me as the, the next sort of right there play. So I'm expecting that we're going to have a breakout probably to two and a half cents coming very, very soon. So uh, let's see how this thing plays out. And remember, this was from the Dev E Launchpad. If you haven't checked it out, you certainly should be checking it out now. Let's move back. Now, don't forget in the meantime that there's another token getting ready to launch. You guys are going to know what to do. This is Taunt. Uh, if you want to register your interest and you click over here, connect your wallet, of course, uh, and then you'll be able to do this. Now, this is coming soon, so it has not launched yet, but it's going to be, I, I believe it's a first-person shooter. I'm not really sure. It's either a first-person shooter or a fighter game or something like that. It's a little something to have fun with, but let's talk about Fias and what it has to offer while we're here. So this is the Fias game. Um, it's called Nice Experience Litcraft, if you will. And what I'm here on, on is mining, and there's tasks for you to complete. So uh, what you have to do is come over here, find your task to complete. What it says for me is I need to mine a red gem. So uh, what you do is you try to find, there we go. Okay, so we've completed a task, and now we get a reward for that. We're going to collect that reward. Now it wants us to find eight red gems. So uh, now we're just going to kind of move around here. And what we're doing, by the way, not all of these red gems are going to be mineable. Only some of them are going to be mineable. So what we're going to do is we're going to move around here, and we're going to keep uh, going until we find uh, new red gems. And we're just going to keep digging and digging and digging until we find the harvestable red gems. And then once we've done that, Ooh, we can't open that yet. All right, so we're getting there. Uh, but uh, you're going to keep finding and finding and finding uh, new places to mine and strengthening your ability until such time as you've gotten the five uh, red gems. Once you've got the five red gems, then it's going to give you another. Uh, and by the way, you move around like this. There you go. So I need to be at least level four in mining in order to uh, continue. So 
what I have to do now, just kind of move around. And again, I'm just looking to mine those uh, red gems at the moment. It's going to take me through this process. It's going to work me, uh, work my way through this so that I know exactly uh, what my ability is to complete whatever task it is, if you will. Uh, and uh, guys, once this is done, then I'll get a new task in. There's, I'm going to gather some land energy. There's different tasks that you can do along the way. And of course, this is uh, if you want to buy something to, to level yourself up, if you want to earn something, then you're going to do that with bias. So um, let's move over here. These are the different games. These are the different things that are available. Now, the mining uh, is the first part. Then you have the farming portion, the equipment portion. Uh, and then, by the way, once you've done your, your, your you, you can collect revenue off of this uh, in the equipment category. Also collect revenue for people buying and selling goods. And then you have a bunch of different games. So uh, if you like, uh, there's plenty of different stuff for you to do. And there's, look, you go over here to Bully Balls TD. And you have to pick your deck. You have to get ready. These are some of your fighting animals. But uh, once you've done this, then you are ready to go. And you, you got to do a, a little bit of it. So we're going to clear that because I don't want to stack my deck at that point. Uh, we're going to return anyway because we haven't finished. So certainly go check this game out. Uh, th there, you're getting a pump right now. On the price action, this could be a continuation. Uh, if you guys are interested, certainly go check it out. Low, low, low market cap. And I suspect, by the way, let's let's be clear here. Um, this is a $75,000 market cap right now with about 40000 in liquidity. This is a, a, a gem, if you will, that people end up finding. What I think is, you know, it goes to, <clears throat> excuse me, it's a small uh, Web3 game. So if it goes to a 10, 15, 20, 30 million dollar market cap, it's not going to be that much in the, the grand scope of the ecosystems at all. But here's the thing. That for you is going to end up being a 30, 40, 50x. So um, whatever you're waiting for, I don't know. Uh, but you probably shouldn't wait much longer because at 1.8 cents, this probably is set for a big, big move. Now, you guys know the drill. If you look at it, you can see here we've come up almost into the previous range. So you know there might be a little bit of sell-off happening over the next little while. Uh, but then we're going to climb to the next level, which is two and a half cents. I told you before. Uh, then we're going to climb and try that next level, which is about three cents. Uh, and then from there, that's where the breakout happens. And then once the breakout happens, uh, we're going to come all the way up here to 6.3 cents. You should be uh, aware of where are you, what is the deal, and right there is your next level of resistance. Next level of resistance, six and a half, next level of true resistance, six and a half cents. That's 4x from where we are right now. So what do you think is going to happen? Uh, very small micro cap, um, functioning, working game for people to play. Everything that you need right here for a massive pump is happening. So what are you waiting for? Go check it out today. It's not financial advice, but I'm always right.